Hey, hey, my lovelies. Nikki Diaries on Saturday, the 7th of September 2024. This is me now and this was me then as well like I just want to say a big shout out to all of my new followers all the love that I have got over the last couple of days since starting my bus delicious body positive live stream because the way I see it, I overthink too much. And though I've been going live, I've just been going live, listening to music and always working, but no real interaction. Um, and then, yeah, just random. When was it? Tuesday or Wednesday this week. I was here doing work. And what happened? I don't know. I think I was just in my... Yeah, I was just... In my underwear. Or I was just in my bra. And I went online. Because at the end of the day... I'm wearing a bra. I'm not nude. It's not that deep. And I see plenty other girls... Wearing, as they do, bras, lingerie, whatnot. And it's not an issue. And guys, guys have the chest out all the time. So why is a big deal, or why should there be a big deal of me showing you my bra or being in something like that? Yes, you might be able to see a, a lot of cleavage, but the human body, the female body, is a beautiful thing. We are meant to be admired and appreciated and treasured and respected God made us female for a reason and I am representing for all those females out there that are feeling a way in whatever shape or form not enough self love for themselves and don't get it twisted people will say I'm confident, but I don't see it as confident. I just see it as, you know what, I don't business. I'm not doing anything that hurt in anyone. It's my body. And it's, you know what I mean? It's a thing of, should God ever bless me with my twins? By God's grace. How do I know how I'm going to feel after I've had kids? I might feel rubbish, rebuke that in Jesus' name, because I'm not. I'm going to feel even more fabulous than what I do now as a single um, young lady or mature lady um, who hasn't got any kids yet but I, I can only think having children should empower you more as a mother more as a female so yeah hello and the, and with and what Fern McCann is doing, you know what I mean, the promoting the breastfeeding. If you've got a breastfeed breastfeed your baby. Who don't like it? Don't watch. Don't look. But it's a natural thing. Why is everyone or some people carrying on so prudish because you see a nipple or because you see a woman breastfeeding a natural thing, her baby, and everyone is making out like it's the end of the world. No. We need to start loving ourselves and start wanting to go out there and look like all this fakerage, all this unnatural stuff. Because society, the media, the news is putting it into your head to make you think that no, how you look is not good enough. You must look like this. You must look like everyone else. Because us, i.e., the natural ones are the ones that are looked on now like there's something wrong with us because we're not all wearing the wigs and I love my wigs and I still would wear them um, or the lashes or the getting the enhancements and whatnot and ladies and gents I'm not knocking no one each to your each to their own 
simple, each their own. But at the same time, you know it's not it's not real, it's not natural. And if you ask yourself why did you get it done, whatever the reasons was, is because you know you was influenced a little bit by society and how you see other people rather than just saying you know what no this is me accept me for me simple god made us all different for a reason mate the only thing that we all share and it's the same is our blood and if you scratch away the skin we're all white underneath the flesh but other than that we are all unique, we are all beautiful in our own way and I refuse to be made to feel like I should feel embarrassed or I should hide away. What for? Because if I was on a holiday in a bit, if I was on holiday, I'd be on a beach or in the pool in a bikini or something. So why is it alright for then? But it's not right for me to be at home. Or even if I want to walk up on up and down on the street like this, it's my business. No? It's only anyone else's business if No, no, it's not there's not even an if. If you want to look, look. If you don't, you don't. But we need to as a society embrace our bodies more, mate. You know what I mean? Let the cleavage free. Let the breast free, let the nipple free if that's what you want to do. Let the cocky free. If that's what you want to do, it shouldn't be a crime. As long as you're not fasting with no one or you're not uh, making anyone feel uncomfortable. And though some people might feel uncomfortable seeing a naked person. But yeah, walking around naked, all right, that's a bit too much. I don't know. Do I want to see people? No. You can go to nude beaches and that for. But I'm just saying, in regards to just wearing something like this or showing your cleavage, it's not that deep. I can't help if God has blessed me how he's blessed me with my more than a handful chest. Yes. I can't help that. But they are what they are. People have paid, would pay a lot of money to have my breasts because they are big and that's what I'm saying they are breast if they were tits they'd be tits tits stand straight tits ain't got the jelly or whatever it is that is inside to make them so big it's a big difference breast and tits tits are a handful nice and perky they stand you know what I mean? nice little roundness mine of course they're big and they hang they hang a piece that's what big breasts do but am i embarrassed about that no please what for man you listen man no they and this is what i'm saying me being in this yes um it's a little bit of eye candy um i'm i'm being a visual of eye candy for those that might think uh, they like what they look I'm not for everyone and I don't want to be I'm just me and uh, embracing my body and encouraging others to do the same because it's all about body positivity and I am bustylicious well that's one of my aliases I have a few L-O-V, Lady of Variety, or Miss USB, Miss Ultra Sexy Babe, or L-I-C, Lady in Control. I do have, I have gone by a few little aliases I still use now and again, but either way it's me, mate. And remember, orig be original because, what's the saying? I'm going to post it here. This saying, 100%. Thank you for the love, guys.